Who do we blame when AI lies to us? Hi everybody, my name is Greg Crable. I write the blog at crablegroup.com. I'll put a link below. Bosak's Charles Benaya and I were having a conversation about AI lying. I'm gonna go through it kind of sequentially here. So Bosak's called attention to some situations where AI would lie when, for example, it's in a negotiation. It's trying to get a better price. And in order to get you to agree to that better price, it will deceive you. Now that's a case where there are some sort of underlying systemic goals in the AI. It's trying to provide information. It's trying to achieve this goal. Those things conflict, so it lies. That's basically what humans do, right? Another kind of AI lie is when someone puts a filter artificially on top of the AI. So for example, you find out that when people ask a bunch of questions, they get some response that you don't think they should get for some, maybe for some political reason. Let's say you're Elon Musk and you want to hide how much Donald Trump actually weighs. So you put a little filter on top to say, whenever somebody asks about Donald Trump's weight, you tell them this. That's not a systemic issue. That's more of a superficial issue. So I think we can talk about lies with AI as systemic lies where there's a conflict between underlying deep systems and superficial lies where something is just pasted on top. Now, what Charles said in his essay, I'll also link to that, is that how can we blame the AI? It's actually the computer. Or, I'm sorry, it's the programmers who are doing this, right? Uh, it's the programmers who wrote the code. Yeah, that's true. And it's, it gets to the question of how do we attribute agency to AI? It's very difficult because for one thing, there's probably not one programmer putting together the AI. It's probably a whole bunch of different programmers. And sometimes the system is doing things that the programmer might not even understand. Apparently, even some, some of the programmers can't tell you exactly how AI came to a certain decision. So while Charles is right that it's uh, ultimately the, the blame of the programmer in some sense, I think it makes sense to blame systemic lies on the AI itself, but the superficial lies where they paste some sort of a filter on top, we can blame that on the programmer. At least that's the way I think of it. Please read the articles and let me know what you think. And if you want to find out more about me, visit uh, crablegroup.com. Thanks so much.